For more than three hours, police surrounded this Florida hospital while a tent standoff was taking place inside. A former employee was threatening people, firing shots in the cafeteria. Anybody that attempted to make contact with him or communicate with him, he just dismissed and pointed the gun at them. Clearly, he appeared to be on a mission. Fortunately, for the others that were in there, they weren't injured. Authorities identified the man as 39-year-old John Jack. They say he eventually barricaded himself in a room before taking his own life. We believe that this whole thing started in, in the Melbourne area where he was having some issues with a property manager um, that apparently was distraught. Um, and he had made some threats as to suicide. No one else was injured during the standoff. Hospital spokesman Elliot Cohen says the gunman worked there for about two years, but was recently fired. He was terminated uh, about a month ago for, uh, for having a poor attendance record. Uh, aside from that, I don't have any other information. Cohen says no one inside was evacuated, and surgeries as well as other operations went on as scheduled. Police say the gunman had a history of mental illness. They say shortly before the standoff, he sent text messages to friends that read, Goodbye. Brian Thomas, The Associated Press.